The Buffalo Bills have dropped two in a row and now host the Detroit Lions in Week 14 for a matchup only betters could love, and that may be a stretch. Steve, got some stats to spice this one up. Yeah, this has been a really down year for Matt Stafford. You look at his career, 7.2 yards per dropback, 0.15 EPA per dropback. This season, just 6.4 yards and 0.04 EPA per dropback. Those might sound like small differences, but across a season, 600 plus dropbacks, those really add up. He's going up against a Buffalo D that's ranked fourth by EPA and second against the pass. You look now, you adjust for schedule. The Bills have had a tough schedule. The Bills are now the better team. I got burned a couple weeks ago betting the Bills, <laughs> took last week off, but I, I may be dipping back in if this one stays under a field goal. All right. Well, you're not the only one betting the Buffalo Bills actually here. Open pick, it's up to minus two and a half, just under the field goal. I find that a bit surprising considering the number of guys that got banged up yesterday and specifically two running backs, LaShawn McCoy, Chris Ivory, both got hurt. Buffalo has been in games in these final drives the past two games, and they won the two games prior to that. So they, they're you know, a much more competitive team with Josh Allen there. Lions just had an ugly win over Arizona on Sunday. The offense continues to sputter. This team is averaging just over 16 points per game in the last seven games. That's not Detroit football. Uh, and their only TD on Sunday was a pick six from Slay. So uh, also, do you want to watch out for the weather in this one? See how the cold weather is going to play in Orchard Park.